Hey y'all, it's me, Eleanor. We've arrived at the Whaler Inn. And we got here. The office was supposed to be open until 10, but they left at 9.20. Nearly gave us heart failure. This is our room C18 on the very end of the top floor. And this is a much older place, but does appear to be clean. There's a kitchenette. The full size refrigerator. And there's a microwave. Table. television and there is a nice balcony out here and I'm sure we'll have a beautiful view tomorrow when the sun comes up and oh look who's with me my mama say hey hey so so far so good we'll keep you posted good morning Atlantic Beach guess what if you stay at the Whaler Inn on Atlantic Beach you literally have the shortest walk to get to the sand and to get to the water than any other beach, any other place, excuse me, any other hotel or condo at Atlantic Beach. And this is how gorgeous it looks this morning. I'm getting ready to go dive into that water. Bye. That water was so wonderful to swim in. I had the best time. So did Mama. It is so nice that the Whaler Inn is situated so close to the water. You do not have to hike up over dunes. Um, there aren't a lot of steps. There was a ramp going down. So it is much more accessible for people with special needs, um, people that just can't walk long distances. Um, and so forth. You don't have as far to haul your cooler or whatever else you carry down to the beach with you. Um, so it's got the best location, I think. I, I can't think of a place that has a better location at Atlantic Beach. Um, it is an older property. It's, it's old. And so if you want something fancy and new, this is not the place for you. But if you don't mind an older property, and very simple decor, you'll like the Whaler Inn. I highly recommend it. I will be going back there and look forward to it. I will give you a couple of tips. Um, if you are going, especially in the evening, call and, and keep in touch with the person there in the office to make sure you know what time they'll be leaving. And if you're gonna be arriving after that, they'll make arrangements for you to get into your room. Um, we made the mistake of not calling. We got to the beach and we were hungry, so we went to get something to eat and so forth. Um, so yeah, get touch base with them and let them know what time you're gonna be arriving and uh, whether or not they'll still be there in the office or not. Um, don't make the mistake I made. I didn't realize there was an elevator. <laughs> and we were on the third floor and I carried all of my luggage and all my mom's luggage up to the third floor. And then one of the other guests, God bless that woman. She's like, oh honey, why don't you take the elevator? And I was like, there's an elevator. Oh. So yeah, don't don't think there's not an elevator. It's tucked down a side corridor. You want to you know check and see where it is, but yes, there's an elevator. And um, if you are using GPS to get there, um, I put in the address, and it took me all over and did not take me to the Whaler Inn. But when I said, take me to the Whaler Inn at Atlantic Beach, then the directions were perfect and took us right in. It is a little hard to see at night. Um, you know, 
if you blink, you could miss it. So I do recommend using your GPS and telling it to take you to the Whaler Inn. Um, and that should do the trick. Anyway, if you've stayed there before, let me know. Um, if you know any other great places like the Whaler Inn, I would love to hear about them. Um, so do share some things in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and um, maybe send it to someone, maybe share it. Thank you. Bye.